Okay, so now we have our, our setup dialog box, um, but it's pretty much useless at this point. Um, we need to get uh, a list of the channels that are in our sequence um, and get them into this combo box so that we can um, select them. Uh, so that's what we're going to do now. <clears throat> so go back to our tutorial. Um, we're actually going to get the, uh, the list of channels. We're going to do it in initialize. Um, and you'll see why in a couple seconds. We're going to uh, make a, a global variable that will hold uh, those channels. And then once we have the channels, we need to find a way to send them to our setup dialog uh, form uh, so that we can use it and add it to our combo box. So uh, that might sound a little confusing, but um, it's really not too bad. Um, so let's go ahead and make a um, another global variable. Uh, we're going to make this um, a list of channels. Um, again, channels is something that's um, defined in Vixen. Uh, we're going to name it channels. Um, and then just a semicolon there. Um, and then we're going to go, uh, like I said, we're actually going to get our channels in initialize. We'll set it to that M channels, and that way we'll have it for our entire uh, plugin. We're going to use um, the executable object has a list of the channels uh, in it. So we will um, use that. So this dot M channels equals executable object dot, and you'll see right down here is channels. And that's just a list of channels. And that's it. We have our channels. <laughs> Not too bad, I don't think. Um, now the next the next part is we have our channels here, but we don't have our channels in our setup dialog. So what we need to do is we need to be able to send uh, that list of channels to our setup dialog. And how we do that, if you go over to setup dialog, our class over here, and view code, um, <clears throat> this is the constructor for our class. Um, right now, there is no when we call this class, nothing gets passed to, uh, gets given to the class uh, to be used. Um, I know that because in the parentheses there is nothing here. Uh, so what we want to do is we want to say, hey, when you open up that class, uh, you need to send me a list of channels. Uh, so what we're going to do is type list channels and it's not showing up and I'll explain why. This is a new um, class that we made and I forgot to put in using Nixon at the top of this class. So once we add that in, channel should appear. Um, and just give it a name. Now, now that we've added this, this class demands that we send it a list of channels. You'll see an error down here saying, hey, um, you're calling channel somewhere else, but you're not sending the information. So just double click on that. It'll take you right back to exactly where um, you initially called the setup dialog. Um, I'm just going to send... Uh, this dot and channels. So now we're sending our channels. Okay, so now we're 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 sending our channels. So um, we need to go back to our uh, dialog class. We just need to put the names of the channels into our combo box. Um, and to do that, uh, we're just going to each. Basically, um, what this is going to do is this is going to go in the list. It's going to go from channel 1, channel 2, channel 3, channel 4. Check the name and put it into the combo box. So each channel 
Uh, just call it CH, you can give it any name. And channels. that's our list of channels. We are going to add that to our combo box. So there's our uh, combo box selected channel items dot add and add the channel name. Okay, and that should do it. Um, so let's build this, see if it works. Okay, and I created a, a, a sequence uh, just so I didn't have to every single time. This just has our um, plugin put into it. Tutorial, plugin setup. Now in here we should have a list of all of our channels. Now what we're going to uh, be doing in, and I'll do it in the next couple parts, um, there's a couple situations that we have uh, that can happen. <clears throat> One is we would like this to be set up as a default, and we'll talk about that. And number two, if we change this to, say, start channel five, if we click on plugins right now, um, we're still getting a full list of the channels, um, which isn't really what we want because, um, for example, channel one isn't getting sent to our plugin, so that's really not a valid channel in this case. So I'll handle that in uh, the next part or two.